What really matters in life? I've had the privilege of hosting four sessions on the topic of what matters in life with people my age getting a little older, kind of wrapping up that first part of their career and in my sessions with these very distinguished people who've included a lot of the top executives from around the world, six factors come up that matter. The first is health. If you don't have your health, the rest of this stuff doesn't matter a lot. So very important, take care of yourself, invest in your health. Uh, in the short term, it may not seem as important what you're doing today, in the long term, it adds up. The second factor is wealth. Wealth doesn't matter though as much as you might think. If you look at studies on uh, happiness versus wealth, what you find out is wealth is important only to a level of kind of a middle class income or maybe slightly above. Beyond that, there's a very low correlation between wealth and happiness. For example, people that win the lottery two years later are not that much happier. Wealth is important, but only to a degree. The third thing that's very important is having positive relationships with people you love. People that have positive relationships with people you love have better relationships at work, better relationships at home, better relationships in life. The next thing is achievement. You need to feel like you're making a difference. You need to feel like you're making some kind of impact in life, that what you're doing is mattering. And then the final two go together, happiness and meaning. And I mention these together because what I found out in our research is you need both. And you need them both simultaneously. If you just go for happiness and you're living a life of amusement, what you find out very quickly is no matter how much money you have or status you have, it gets old. You're doing stuff that's fun and amusing, but it's not meaningful. On the other hand, if you're doing something that's meaningful, but it doesn't make you happy, well, that doesn't work either. You're a victim or a martyr. So it's very important in life as you look at the rest of your life to consider six factors. Number one, am I doing my best to stay healthy? Number two, am I taking care of my wealth to the degree that I'm gonna have at least a middle class, upper middle class income? Number three, am I working hard to build those positive relationships with people I love? Number four, am I achieving? Do I feel like I'm making a positive impact or difference? And then finally, am I simultaneously achieving happiness and meaning? Am I doing what is meaningful for me and what makes me happy at the same time? And nobody can define happiness for you but you, and nobody can find meaning for you but you. If you say, I'm doing these six things, you're going about as far as you can to have a great life.